Yo, what up peeps? Watching um, seven transforming vehicles that you've never seen before. Let's see if they're really awesome. I doubt it very much. Number one, number one. I'm over here, by the way. I'm just turning back on my back. Bow, 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 bow. Number one, we have the Aeromobile at 3.0. Is it good? We have no idea. Does it even fly? It's probably just a prototype. It does not look like it can fly, but if it can fly, then it's amazing. It's a nice color. I like the white and blue. The white and blue is a very nice mixture of color. Why does no cars have gradients though? It's not even cars, it's a fucking helicopter or some sort of shit. Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking because, um, yes. So far, I would say that it's a very nice car. Um, motorbike, um, aeroplane, whatever the hell it is, it looks like an aeroplane. They're taking that for a test flight right now. Um, overall, I'd say it's pretty alright. I would buy that for personal use if I knew how to fly it. If it had a fucking eject, ejection eject seat so that I can fly away if there's any trouble um, quite cool it's actually flying mate what the fuck so it does work damn son damn that is nice bro whoa I'm never gonna be able to afford that but if I do I'm gonna be flying that road I'm gonna fly across the country I'm gonna go to a different country I'm gonna get shot down by our enemies and the Russians the Russians are gonna shoot me down number two let's go Alright, that's this one. The Hum Rider. Oh, so what we see so far is the car can lift and what I'm assuming is that it can go past other cars in traffic. Now, if everyone had that, the, car, the whole thing would just be a total mess and no one would like to be using that because, yeah, it's just a waste of time. It's just something you would show off once in a million, once in a, one, one time and that's it. You just let go of it. This man's like, what the fuck is that? It's all set up, man. These are people recording it for fun. They all know about it anyway. Hurrah! Would you buy that car, guys? I would not buy that car. Nah. Probably cost shitloads of money just so it can transform. That's... You, don't, you won't see everyone pressing that button just to pass traffic, mate. There's just no point. And then what's going to happen when you get to the end of the traffic? And then you can't... Um, you can't get down because you're stuck at the traffic lights. Nah, bruh. Waste of money, waste of time. This car looks good. I'm not gonna lie, the orange is spot on perfect. It looks nice, mate. Wow. Letrons. It's a very nice car. I love the tinted windows. <coughs> I love the tinted windows of it as well. It looks quite cool. That's one car I would buy. I want to see what it transforms into now. I uh, have no idea. Electrons. Might have to look at some cars by Electrons because that is stylish. That's what you call quality. Bro. Quality! Whoa! Everyone stand back! It's transforming! Oh my god! Whoa! Can it walk though or does it just do that? Come on! No, that's fake. There's no way that it can do that. Yeah, I bet. Sure, bro, sure. So what does it do now then? Just go back into car position? Or is that how you park it? Is that how you park your car, yeah? Little stupid robot face. I can't hear what it's saying, but I'm listening to music. So. The eyes, what? Dynamic goes, oh, that's Turkish. Zengin Gershu Solen Ve Media. Oh shit, it's Turkish, bro. Damn, dude. I'm not proud to be Turkish. <laughs> Why is the arms moving? For what reason does the arms need to move? Man. Bilek Hareketi. 200 NCM DC Servo. No idea. Steering. Mm. That's a nice car, but I don't like the transformation mode. I don't I don't like it. They need to rethink what they're doing because that just looks really stupid. There's no point to it at all. 43 seconds it takes. What? Uh, it's alright. Is that something you'd take to camping or something? It's pretty cool. See, that's useful. Those stuff, you can do stuff with it, you know what I mean? Where there's a transformer vehicle, it's pointless. Pointless, mate. Pointless. 
And it's got a kettle, a kitchen inside of it. Wow. That's quite impressive, dude. Wow, that's like a king size bed. Damn, son. God damn. Wildfennec.com. Nah. Five. Ooh, this looks like it's going to be shit. It's like it's going to double up in size or something. Double back VW. All right. Camper. Camper vehicle. I wouldn't buy it just for the looks, mate. Like, the looks are just horrible. I can't stand cars that don't look good. I know you're going to need something if you're going camping, but, bro, I can't. I would not buy that shit. What the fuck is this, man? What's wrong with you? Whoa. It extends. Whoa, the whole fucking vehicle extends. Shit. Whoa. That is live, mate. It's a shame they couldn't make the vehicle look a lot better. Damn. Sick. And it becomes a kitchen, though. Whoa. That's what you call spliff. Uh... Would you guys buy that? Let me know in the comments below which one you would buy. I think we've got two more, though. I think we've got two more. Um, six. All right, get on with it. Uh, this one, I just love the white. It just already looks like it's going to be a cool-ass machine. Okay, nah. I wouldn't buy that. That must cost a shitload of money, though. Look how big it is. Fuck, you know, it's like an RV, and this shit's pissing me off, yo. I'm going to come out in the fucking thing. Uh, what do you put in there? It's a car. No, is that a car within a car? What? There is no way, bro. Whoa, that fucking shit is moving, bro. These are for wealthy people, boy. Like, there's no one like at my stage that can buy that shit, honestly. Vario Mobile, Mobile. Love it. I would definitely love to buy one of those one day and go camping somewhere. Fucking hell, touchable lights, boy. Any air conditioning, mate? Yeah, fucking hell. Dishwasher? What? It's like a proper living room, mate. What? There's a bed in the ceiling. Oh my days. That's one hell of an RV boy, number seven. Damn, son. I bet this is going to be epic. You got to wait for the last one. EO Smart Connecting Car. It's really horrible, though. What the fuck? The guys are doing it on the street, man. Whoa. Did that just turn around 360 degrees? What the fuck? Whoa. It turned into a proper car. And then, look at the wheel as well. What? I mean, the steering wheel. That is crazy. And then it transforms for what reason? I don't understand. Um, What's that supposed to be? It looks really weird. Again, like, I'm more on looks when it comes to cars. I don't think I'll buy this. Um, I'm not going to lie. It does look quite cool the way it maneuvers, but it seems like a pointless creation. Obviously, for the future, you know, they can benefit with that idea. Whoa, look at that. Holy shit, it's going sideways like a crab, bro. Shit. Oh, I like that. I like that. Yeah. <coughs> it's like an alien type of vehicle. Okay, now, what is the point of that? I don't understand what the whole point of that would be. And... All right, guys, I'm not going to lie. That was actually pretty okay. Um, transforming vehicles are quite cool, actually. I thought that was all right. It's not the best. The, the orange one was amazing, but I still didn't like the way it transformed. There was no point of that. I did not like it one bit. Overall, I'd say that was uh, quite cool. And um, if you liked the video, hit the subscribe, hit the share, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's hope they create better shit than that. That orange car needs to transform into something that is useful, you know, and then it'll be cool. All right, see you in a bit, guys. Bye. Pop, pop, pop.